information on ballasting. I've been asked about cleaning, how do you clean the track afterwards, etc, etc. Well, all I do really is I use my track rubber, the old one here, and go down the track, give it a good clean, obviously. You get a bit of PVA onto that. And same down the sleepers. And then if you've got some gravel stuck on the inside, what I do is I use my thumbnail, just run it down the inside, it gets it off. A fingernail. You can do it on the outside if you want then. And there you should have a nice clean track. Just uh, get the vacuum back then bit truck. Clean track ready for whatever you want to do. In fact, what I'll go do now is I'll go on to what I'll do is I'll put some paint on the board uh, or paint green and then uh, later on I'll show on how to uh, apply grass and static grass. Um, I'll just paint it green down the side as the undercoat for the grass and it's easier over the base. I'll finish this and bring it on later when it's all done. One other thing I was asked is uh, how do you go on with curved track? Does it work on curved track? Yes it works just the same. As you see underneath the gadget, the baluster, there's two grooves there which sit on the track. So if you put it on the track, as you can see, it just slides down. So it doesn't matter whether it's curved or straight. Next stage is uh, bring the grass down. I'll put a base grass down first and then we'll do the static grass later. I've just uh, covered the track over a bit of newspaper. Uh, the spray of PVA mix. This is a less thick mix. I should say about 20%, 25% PVA, rest is water. And then I'll just use a tea strainer with the grass and just sprinkle out over the PVA. Just get to do a covering. And then the best thing to do is to just put a bit of darker colour near the edge of the track. So you can make your own colours up. Uh, I'm going to then just put another spray over the top and do a seal that on and give that another 12-24 hours to dry. And then I'm going to put the static grass all over the static grass. That'll be fine there now. I've just put a bit of tape down that side there so we'll just put some grass on the other side. I'm gonna say it's only a demo of this so it's Whatever you want done. I mean, probably put some buildings there or whatever and just, just make do with painting grey. I say I give that another 24 hours to dry now and then we'll say we'll put the static grass on. Just lift that tape up so we get a small side for the. You can have that as a road there. Right, to be continued. Right, this has dried up nicely now. Uh, it's just about 24 hours. Uh, I've got my static grass applicator here, which again bought on eBay, about £15. Um, you just need to put a nail in to uh, to earth it. 
that's all it is, it's a battery in the handle. So we'll just make a start now. We start by putting a put some PVA on. This is a again a mixture of about uh, about 20%, 30% PV, PVA and water. Put it all over the area we're going to do. I'll just do a small bit just for this, show you how we do it. Then we load the static grass into the. Oops, oops going all over. Switch on and apply. Here's the shake. You can see now we're covering there. It should stand up, shouldn't it? In fact, I'll bring the camera lower down and you can see better. Just hang on a minute. As you can see, as I put it near the grass, the grass is lifting. You can, again, different mixes, whatever you want. This is a, a spring grass, I think there's autumn grass, there's mixed grass. There's probably some longer ones, maybe somebody will let me know. Uh, they're not that long a strand, these. But here you can see, Electric. <coughs> Somebody else told me you could rub a balloon on your head, and you know you get that electric effect from them. I've tried it, but it didn't work with mine, so I've probably got no electricity made. But this seems to work all right. And I say there's probably longer strands of grass. When you finish, important thing to do is you must touch that because touch the nail to. Get rid of the discharge, there you are, that's safe now. <coughs> and there you go. I'll just finish that off and then I'll just show you the finished. All oh, clean and running smoothly. And there we have it. Uh, I stuck a tree in there just to add a little bit of effect. As I say, it was only a demonstration, this. You can do what you want with it, but uh, quite good is that. And I say, if somebody will come back to me saying whether there's uh, longer strands of static grass, uh, I'd be interested to hear. Thanks for watching, anyway.